uh, I'm going to be a little more selfish and talk about myself today and um, give you a little bit of the, the fusion journey I've been on and why I've come from being a fusion skeptic that I think many people in this audience have. So I said, great, I'm going to go solve that problem. Um, and a little naively looked to the universe and said, great, there's fusions out there. It's where most of the mass and the energy in the universe comes from. I should do that, and we should bring that here on Earth. Um, got into it, uh, actually became an expert in some of the inertial uh, type approaches, like the laser systems. Actually, my specialty was antimatter. Uh, antimatter is cool, but what, what I learned was that actually the technologies of the time when I was learning that I learned in school, um, those approaches, and we all sort of see that in the world, um, they're going to work. But when they do, I will have already retired, if not, like, not actually be alive to turn on the machines I was going to go build. And so I pivoted my career, went and built space propulsion systems and rockets, plasma thrusters, hull, hull thrusters, ion engines, that kind of thing. And it wasn't until I met our core founding team that I saw another way to do fusion uh, that potentially rapidly skips over some of the steps of what others are doing. So that's what I want to introduce you to today. Um, our technology, the way we want to do fusion, that we believe gets, gets humanity to fusion as soon as possible.